Hey everyone and welcome. My name is Melissa Arma and I own a company called The Stock Swoosh. And tonight I wanted to talk about a topic. And the topic is actually, it, it's, it's actually called sticking up for yourself. It's actually, you need to stick up for yourself and listen to your intuition. I received a wonderful compliment last week and it made me think about this topic and why I wanted to do a video from my broker. And I'll tell you how it came about. I, I am in an option, I'm in several options actually for the market long, okay? The market has been falling and gapping down and I'm, I'm in these trades. I did them like a few weeks ago, okay? And actually I've added to the trades. That's another topic I'll talk about later, but let me get back to the story. The broker called me and she said, Melissa, I, I, I got to hand it to you. And I said, what are, what are you talking about? What do you mean? And she said, you, you will do amazing on live television and you're, you do great yourself because you never listen to anyone else but yourself. And I, and I laughed at that and I actually took it as a compliment and I, and she meant it as a compliment. This is my AE at the broker, but I'm saying to you, that is something that if I could, if I could bottle it up and sell it <laughs> for $9.99 or whatever, I, I would make a killing because that, that specific quality that I have, I don't even know what it's called. I have to make up a word. It's like, it's like I actually ignore everyone else and go with my gut. It's, it's my intuition. Okay. I go with my intuition. So my intuition says, I'm going to ignore everything everyone else says. I'm going to look at the information and make a decision that's valid based on what I know about gaps in the market. Know that being law in the market is fine, that nothing is wrong. It's not doing anything wrong. And we're still holding the uptrend. And I guess the point my broker was trying to make is that she thought it was amazing that I could, I could just get up and do trades like this and add to the trades and take the trades and feel conviction and be okay with it and sleep at night, which I do, obviously. And despite the fact the market's gapping down, but I'm telling you the market's not short, it's a long, but I don't want to get off on that trail. The point I'm trying to make is for you tonight to go with your gut and listen to yourself. It may be hard for you to do that if you're not used to doing that. In other words, if you've lived your entire life, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 years, and you've never trusted yourself and you've never listened to yourself, you're going to have a hard time starting to do it. It's a process. It's like a journey. It's like you have to baby step it. Little by little by little by little, you learn to trust yourself. If you can't trust yourself based on your own intuition to make the right decisions in your life, then, then who is going to trust you? I guess that's the point I'm trying to make. And one of the reasons that I do well trading and teaching people how to trade and trading live in front of people every day with my own money and the fact that I'm going to do the television show, I mean, live on TV and make the calls is because of the fact that I block out the world, use the information that I know based on the 26 point gap rating system, validate it, look at the chart, figure it all out, ignore everything else, go with it, take the trade, do it, that's it. And the point and the lesson for tonight is that you have to look at the information, make decisions based on that, trust yourself and your intuition. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, when I say the word intuition, that is something that you have to start investigating. Read books about it. Talk to me about it. It's it's real. I'm not making this up. This isn't some la 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 fantasy thing. You actually have something called an intuition or gut in yourself that tells you, I want to do Melissa's class. I want to learn this thing about gaps. It works. I can make a lot of money in the market. I'm tired of my job. I don't want to keep doing this for the next 50 years. I know I can make more money. I'm sick of this place. What, whatever, whatever your intuition says. I'm tired of this relationship. You, you got to listen to your gut. And if you don't start trusting yourself now, when are you ever going to trust yourself? Today, tomorrow, 2018, 2020, 2025, the sooner you learn to trust yourself, the better off you're going to be. The more successful you will be in your life. And that is more than money. It has to do with being happy, enjoying what you do with your time in your life, your personal relationships, and also your success in the market. Have a great night, everyone. I'll see you. This is Melissa at thestockswish.com. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night.